Eileen Mayhew. I'm an oil painter. I have an exhibit coming up in Imago Gallery in Warren called Coastal Communities. So this is uh, my painting called Juniper Trail Beach, Kikimuit River. It's actually of this side of the river right here. Uh, you can see this house right here in the background. All my paintings are taken from the point of view of a boat. I've spent a lot of time on the water and it's a unique and beautiful view. And I wanted to highlight that and show people what they may not have already noticed. The idea of my work is not to re reproduce something photographically, but as Alberto Giacometti said, the object of art is not to reproduce reality, but to produce a reality of the same intensity. And also I'm interested in producing my time, um, how things have changed since I moved in this area and how they will continue to change. This is how it looks now. This house right here didn't even exist when I first moved into this area. And this house has changed dramatically. Also, this wall did not exist when I first moved in here because of the, uh, the action of the waves and the rising of the waters because of climate change. It was eroding the street, so the state had to put in this wall to protect these, the uh, public road. This one is called Everett Street, Kickamuit River. It's actually of the west side, and you can see that point right there, that's what this house is. And even that, since the beginning, has changed quite a bit uh, since years ago. Uh, it was just a, 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 a hip roof when we first moved in, and now it has this addition on it. I've done 11 of these panoramic paintings, and they're all done on a mahogany veneer panels, uh, which I uh, put uh, gesso on, and then I paint black. Um, what I like to do is uh, use the black uh, ground in order to create uh, more contrast. And then while it's painted black, I'll start with the sky and, and then do the water. And then I'll work my middle tones uh, in between. Uh, I like to work on a black panel because it helps me to achieve contrast. Um, ordinarily, when I work on a white canvas or a panel, I work from dark to light, put my darks in first, but the darks are already there on a black panel, so I'll work from light to dark, and I can actually achieve better contrast that way. In all of the paintings, I worked with palette knife because I wanted to uh, create atmosphere, and I do that by creating texture in the sky and the water, but also in the trees. I'll put the paint down really, really thick let it dry and then I can go in and working from dark to light with my reds and my oranges and my greens and my browns and even purples building up with a brush. This series has taught me a great deal about painting. I couldn't believe that I could continue to learn but it really happens that way and uh, I do things a little bit differently now too especially painting on a black background a, a, a black uh, panel. I never did that before, and it's opened up a whole new world to me. One of my favorite artists is Fairfield Porter, who is a plein air painter from Maine, and he said, the profoundest, the profoundest order is revealed in what is most casual. He painted his everyday life, and that's what I'm trying to do as well taking it onto a grand scale, and taking it out along the rivers and the bays and along the ocean in Rhode Island.